And a very pleasant good evening, everyone, and welcome to another broadcast here on 956sports.com and also coming to you on KHGN-TV. I'm Joe Bowling with you on a Friday night in Harlingen, and the matchup tonight, the Edinburgh Bobcats in town to take on the Harlingen Cardinals. We're set to go with the opening tip-off. Harlingen in the white uniforms with the red trim and in the red uniforms with the blue trim as the Edinburgh Bobcats the last time these two teams met. What a thriller that ended in a three-pointer at the buzzer and a Bobcat victory this time. Harlingen on their home court trying to uh, even the series between the two teams on the regular season. Harlingen with the basketball in the opening tip and away we go, first quarter action. Ball tipped over in the left-hand side. Cardinals working around the perimeter, still looking in the deep left baseline now. A nice pass inside, shot goes up off the glass, it won't go, rebound. Right there, put it up and in, Cardinals score, and that's Charlie Powers on the stick back. They worked it inside, Powers got the offensive rebound. 2-0 the score, 7.30 to go in the first quarter. Bobcats of Edinburgh with the ball, first time on the offensive set for Edinburgh. Michael Harrison catches the ball. He was moved up from the JV squad midway through the season, and he's an integral part of what is now the varsity squad down the stretch here in the regular season. Long shot or a pass goes inside. Rivera goes up, the shot got fouled. And so Gabriel Rivas, the 6'3 junior, will head to the free throw line for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Thanks again for joining us here on a Friday night here as we continue our coverage of high school athletes in the Rio Grande Valley. Location is Harlingen, Edinburgh Bobcats in town. Rivas listed at 6'3. The junior knocks the first free throw down. 2-1 the score, Edinburgh with their first point of the evening. It comes at the 7-11 mark here of quarter number one. Next free throw coming up for Gabriel Rivas. Made that as well. Evens the game at two apiece. Little token pressure in the backcourt by the Bobcats, but the Cardinals beat it easily. Get it in the front court. Ball in his hands is Robles. Hands it off to Reza. Reza has it, top of the key. Here's a three-pointer on the way by Ibarra that won't go. Rebound taken down by Noe Espetacueta for the Edinburgh Bobcats. The running Bobcats get it in the offensive end and lose it on a turnover. As Harrison turns it over, here come the Cardinals. Quick pass to Robles, lay it up and in, got it. Four two cards on top, Edinburgh with the ball. 6.40 to go in the first quarter. Bobcats on the offensive end, running the point this trip down is McCaleb. McCaleb takes it up for me, right side pass. Harrison attacks on the baseline, has the ball knocked away and a travel is gonna be called as he got it pinned on his hip trying to make the final move. Second turnover of the ball game against the Edinburgh Bobcats. Substitution pops in. Another one of those guys that was called up for the JV squad for the Edinburgh Bobcats late in the season, and that's Robert Hinojosa, who will check in, a freshman wearing number 30. Pressure in the backcourt, the Bobcats extended to three-quarter court. Cards throw over the top of that, get it quickly to the baseline. Nice move made up and under. Shot won't go, though. Rebound taken down by the Bobcats. Ball knocked out of bounds. It'll be Edinburgh ball. Charlie Powers made the move, just missed on the finish. 4-2 the score with the Harlingen Cardinals on top. They're back on the defensive end. Quickly, a pass to McCaleb. McCaleb attacks to the right side. Stopped his dribble, hands it off to Rebus. Running one-hander, no go. Tip it up and in on his own. Nobody blocked him out. Following the shot, Rebus puts it in. Rebus on the night has all four points for the Edinburgh Bobcats and ties the game with 5.58 to go in the first quarter. Cardinals with the basketball. Ibarra has it. His pass deflected and it gets over there to Robles. Robles, his pass is taken away, and on a turnover, here come the Bobcats. Quick pass ahead to a spare quake to tip out of bounds. Nice hustle that time by Matthew Cervantes, getting back for the Harlingen Cardinals. The 6-2 sophomore tips it out of bounds. Otherwise, that was layup city. 5.45 to go in the first quarter. Bobcats looking for the lead on the inbound play. McCaleb having trouble getting it in. Fires it in the left corner on the dribble. Now a pass inside of It goes to work, shot blocked out of there, out of bounds it goes, stay here. Cervantes sent the Espiriqueta shot out of bounds on the baseline. McCaleb will set him in motion once again for the Edinburgh Bobcats. In the corner, quick jumper on the way by Garza, back of the rim that won't go. Rebound by Powers and here come the Cardinals. Slowing the pace is Ibarra. Daniel Ibarra right down the middle of the floor. 5.27 and counting here in the first quarter of play. Ibarra catches once again. Has it at the top of the key. Zone defense set up. Lobs it over everyone and threw it away. He misread the baseline cut that time and the turnover occurred. That's turnover number two against the Harlingen Cardinals here in the first quarter. Edinburgh with the ball. Tie game at four apiece. Right side pass to Garza, back to McCaleb, intercepted, and here comes Ibarra, one man to beat, that's McCaleb, elevates, lays it up and in. He 
Bonner, after he stole it, had one man to take care of, and he did so. Here's McCaleb on the backside, has the ball knocked away, but recovers, maintains control. Espiriqueta, fadeaway jumper, splash. Noe Espiriqueta in rhythm that time on the catch and shoot. Ties the game at six apiece. What a move made by a razor to get away from nearly being tripped. Jumper on the way, up, in, three, counted, Daniel Ramirez. Shot goes up, and now he's going to whistle in a foul. 4.27 to go. Three-pointer was made by the Arlington Cardinals. We'll take that and see who exactly shot that ball. Screened was I from a backboard that's preventing me to get a good look in that corner. Meanwhile, Michaela with the free throw line for the Edinburgh Bobcats hits the first. Couple of substitutions in the game. Dimas Camacho wears number 24 in the game for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Also checking in. New player in the game for the Bobcats. Free throw, Michaela rattles in. 9-8 to score. Harlingen on top, Cardinal basketball. Cervantes nearly travels. Quick pass around the outside. Robles attacks through a double team. Kissed it off the glass and got it to go. Eve Robles, the six-foot senior, scores. He's got four points on the night. Edinburgh launching a three back of the rim that won't go. Rebound by the Harlingen Cardinals and back we come the other way. Ahead to Cervantes, dribbled it, out of bounds, turn over. Cervantes in the open court, trying to dribble it against a double team. Turnover number three against the Harlingen Cardinals. Substitution now in the ball game for the Harlingen Cardinals. Edinburgh basketball, McCaleb has it across the timeline. Top of the key as they'll work this defense of the Harlingen Cardinals. Underhanded pass, caught by Rivas. Rivas in the corner, McCaleb makes a great move. Quick, strong layup, good. Nick McCaleb beat one man with a ball fake and then took it baseline, strong and finished. 3.32 to go in the first quarter, 11-10 to score. Jumper, Harlingen shot too strong by Charlie Powers. Rebound, McCaleb. Here come the Edinburgh Bobcats. Trailing by one here, three-pointer, McCaleb, a deep three that won't go. Rebound, controlled by the Bobcats. Baseline jumper up, off the rim, no good. Rebound, Harlingen Cardinals, powers all over it. Quick shot up, rejected out of bounds with 3.05 to go in the first quarter. Spiriqueta returns to the ball game for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Also back in the game, Matthew Garza. Harlingen basketball, 3.05 to go here in the first quarter. 11-10, your score. Thanks again for joining us here for live broadcast. Or in the case of HGTN or TV, channel 17. Welcome aboard. Shot up and in for the Cardinals. They're up now 13-10. McCaleb has the ball for Edinburgh. There's Spirit Quaint. He's left open for a moment. Didn't shoot. He will next time. Get it back outside to McCaleb. Attacks. Underhanded shot. Deflected. Block on his own board. Put it up and in. That first one was actually a shot attempt by McCaleb. Now quickly, here come the Harlingen Cardinals in the front side. Baseline jumper off the back of the rim, no good. But to the free throw line will go Jaime Garza. Garza that time beat the Edinburgh Bobcats down court. And so with 2.35 to go here in the first quarter, it'll be free throw time for Garza. Listed at 5'11", a junior. First one good. 14-12, Harlingen on top. And the first meeting between these two teams, it was cold shooting for a while, and then all of a sudden Harlingen got red hot beyond the three-point arc. And then Edinburgh started matching him. Rimming in the second free throw, no good. It rolls out. Rebound by McCaleb. Here come the Edinburgh Bobcats. McCaleb has it front side. Left wing pass to Garza, to Rivas. Rivas, jumper, 17, got it. Gabriel Rivas now has six points on the night. Harlingen back with the ball. Tie game at 14 apiece. 2.16 remaining first quarter action. Off the dribble is Reza. Now they flip a pass over to Ramirez. Ramirez rolls a pass out, threw it away. Turnover coming up against the Cardinals. That's their fourth of the night. Shooting wise, Harlingen, six of 10 as a team, 60% in the ball game. Five of eight inside the arc for 63%. One of two beyond the arc. One of two at the free throw line. Four turnovers though. 
Edinburgh right here in the game. Three-pointer by Garza, no good. Rebound, it comes out, Harlingen secures it. Robles has the ball in the backcourt. Front side action as they go to Garza. Garza to Robles, flips the pass to Powers. Outside for a three-pointer on the way up and in, made by Reza. Gilbert Reza with a three. Cards back on top, 17-14 with a minute 40 left here in the first quarter. McCaleb has the ball off the dribble, spins into a double team. The ball rolls out of bounds, turnover against Edinburgh. McCaleb tried to back his way through a double team. Once you lose your vision of who's defending you with either hand, awfully tough to regain momentum as you spin back and face up. Ball knocked out of bounds, touched last by Edinburgh. Substitutions into the ball game for the Harlingen Cardinals. Wearing number five is Omar Hunter. He'll check in. And it's Cardinal basketball also in the ball game. Wearing 23 is David Pryor. Pryor helps run the point. They'll work it in the corner to Hunter. Here's a deeper three, this time by Reza. Back of the rim that won't go. Rebound, Espiricueta secures that for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Here comes McAuliffe. McCaleb attacks, right hand shot, up off the glass, no good. Rebound, Cardinals right there, uh, Bobcats right there, but wave it off. Push off on Gabriel Rivas, says the official. And with a minute 11 to go in the first quarter, it'll be Harlingen basketball, they're up. I got them up three in 17-14. Minute four to go now as the Cardinals have it. Work it inside. Nice up and under pass. Shot rejected out of there. And here come the Bobcats of Edinburgh in the front court. No numbers. Now they'll attack at the free throw line. Whipping a pass inside of Spear Quake to catch his shoot. Missed the layup. Rebound by the uh, Cardinals. That's going to be Hunter coming down with it. Cardinals on a run. Up layup. Up and under. Good by Garza. Beat him down court. Garza with the finish. Cards now up five at 19-14. Edinburgh with the basketball. 33 seconds left in the first quarter. Spear Quaita turns. Fade away jumper the free throw that won't go. Rebound. Reza has it. Knocked out of his hands. Bobcats with it. Retained possession for a moment. McCaleb has it. Turns. Waits. Shot it. Missed it. Got fouled. 21 seconds left here in the first quarter. Harlingen leading 19-14. McCaleb to the free throw line. 6-1 senior, two of two on the night thus far. He's got a total of six points. First free throw good. Edinburgh now five of five at the free throw line in this first quarter. Spear Quaita will have a seat on the bench. Garza replaces him. Meanwhile, McAuliffe at the free throw line. Nick McAuliffe, 6-1, a senior. First one on, or made it. Second one this time, back of the rim, rolls in. So McCaleb leads the Bobcats in scoring with eight first quarter points. Cardinals in a hurry, get the ball on the offensive end. Skip pass over the top, get in the corner, now work it around the perimeter. Overhead pass, back in the corner, baseline move, jumper, fadeaway, tough shot, won't go. Rebound, McCaleb comes out of there with it for the Bobcats and he's fouled. Tough look that time by David Pryor, trying to get that shot away for the Harlingen Cardinals. Cardinals up 19-16 with three seconds left here in the first quarter. Bobcats are going to have to get the ball down court with a deep pass first. Having trouble, now they'll get it in. Three-quarter court shot coming up. Here she comes. No good. Cardinals lead after one. 19-16 your score. Eight minutes on the clock as we get set for the second quarter. Cardinals make their way back out on the court. Here come the Bobcats. It'll be Edinburgh basketball to start quarter number two. Again, 1916, your score if you're just joining us. Second quarter action coming your way on a Friday night in Harlage. And McCaleb has the ball. And here come the Edinburgh Bobcats trailing by a three spot. Works the offense to Garza on the right wing. Garza to a spear equate to Dipson inside for Rivas. Nice deflection and an interception. Charlie Powers with the steal. Right back at you, steal, and the Bobcats of Edinburgh get it back. Edinburgh basketball. Emilio Trejo runs the point, wearing number 11, hands it off to McCaleb. McCaleb to Garza. Garza puts it on the floor, got a screen, attacks to the right baseline, all the way, flip it up, no good. Rebound, Harlingen Cardinals, Cervantes comes out of there with it. Back come the cards. Neither team has scored here in the second quarter. Underhanded pass for a three by Robles. No good. Rebound. 
And that's a Spiracueta with another board. That's his third of the game. Spiracueta hands it off to McCaleb. Here come the Bobcats. McCaleb attacks in the lane. Shot rejected out of there. Cardinals with it. Outlet pass in the direction of Charlie Powers. Couldn't get there in time, and back we come the other way. Bobcats back with the ball. Trejo attacks in the air. Left it short on the jumper. Outlet pass. Here comes Robles ahead of everybody with the right hand. Count it. Pete Robles beat him down court, and the running Bobcats just got outran. 21-16, the score was 6.52 to go here in the half. Timeout on the floor. Scoring-wise for the Harlingen Cardinals, Gilbert Reza leads the way with five points. Also, Daniel Ibera has five. On the flip side, Nick McCaleb leads the way for the Edinburgh Bobcats with eight first-half points. Bobcat bat, will he be on the defensive end? Or check that, it'll be their ball, it should be. McCaleb will throw it in. Full court pressure set up by Harlingen. It's man to man. McCaleb to throw it in. Good overplay by the Harlingen Cards. They'll get it in, nearly stolen. It's deflected, still loose in the backcourt. Now here come the Bobcats. No numbers, a one on three, and the whistle blows, and the foul is going to be called. Michael Harrison took the ball against a one on three and gets rewarded. With the foul, 6.45 to go in the half. Substitution into the ball game. Dimas Camacho returns for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Non-shooting foul, team foul number five on the Harlingen Cardinals here in the first half. And it'll be Edinburgh basketball on the offensive end of the baseline as McCaleb throws it into Revis. They knock it out of his hands. He recovers, and a quick jump ball is going to be called. Possession arrow, Cardinals. Revis caught the pass right around his hip, didn't get the ball up in time, and was quickly tied up. Harlingen basketball, they scored the only two points here in quarter number two after leading 19-16, currently up 21-16. As the Cardinals have the ball. Ibarra, top of the key, between the legs with a dribble, backs away from the defense of McCaleb, lost his dribble. Free throw line to Robles, Robles turns, shot it, rattled it out, no good. Rebound by McCaleb for the Edinburgh Bobcats. They get back defensively, so he'll set it up on the offensive end. Working it to the right side, McCaleb. Top of the key, Harrison. Harrison over to Garza. Garza flips it inside. Nice pass. Shot blocked out of there by the Cards once again. Block shot that time by Garza. Quick pass in the corner. Garza attacks. Hangs in the air. Shot it. Might have been blocked just a little bit. And the rebound taken down by the Edinburgh Bobcats. And a foul in the backcourt against Cervantes. Matthew Cervantes all over Dimas Camacho, says the official. Stops the clock with 5.56 remaining in the half in a 21-16 game. Edinburgh basketball. They still haven't scored yet here in the second quarter. Only two points scored in the quarter alone. That was by the Cardinals of Harlingen. Edinburgh operates the offense, and now they'll attack. Garza pulls up for the jumper off the dribble. That won't go. Rebound to Harlingen. They want to run. Garza has it in the open court. Top of the key. Elevates. Flips the pass over. Here's a three. Answer there. No. Front of the rim. Rebound. Bobcats all over that on the back side. Harrison secured the board. Edinburgh down five. 21-16 to score. 5-20. And counting here in the second quarter. Bobcats work the offense. Garza has it. Flips it to Rivas. They knock it out of his hands again. Cardinals with it, a pass to Cervantes. Can he get there in time? Garza on the defense, deflects it, but a foul is going to be called on Garza. Turnover led to the run out by Cervantes. Garza went for the tip just as Cervantes was elevating for the layup. Cervantes at the free throw line at the 507 mark of quarter number two, looking for his first point of the evening. A lefty, first free throw, no good. Cards now one of three from the free throw line here in the first half. Second free throw coming up by Matthew Cervantes, the 6-2 sophomore. Missed that one. Rebound, Edinburgh, Garza into a double team. Dangerous pass, but it gets over to Harrison, and now they'll set it up. Front side action as Garza has it. They'll run a weave out on top. Bobcats of Edinburgh down five. They went three minutes here in the second quarter without scoring. Garza probes the defense, nothing there. 
Running a three guard set at the top of the key here. Now a deflected pass is gonna be stolen. Here come the Cardinals, quick pass. Left side, Garza banks it, no good. Rebound for the Edinburgh Bobcats. They wanna run in the backcourt, now front court. Harrison threw a double team. They take it out of his hands and steal it. Back come the Harlingen Cardinals. They literally took that away. Cervantes catches, turn, shot it, banked it in. Matthew Cervantes, the 6'2 sophomore, knocks him a couple. 23-16, it's a seven point lead for the Harlingen Cardinals, thanks in part to a 4-0 run here in the second quarter. Bobcats of Edinburgh, lob it into Rivas, catches, protects the ball this time, turns, puts it on the floor, spins again, banks it up and in. Gabriel Rivas that time on the finish, he's got eight. That's the first point scored here in the second quarter. Took him half the quarter to get there. Three-pointer by the Cards. Rebound tipped and controlled by Rivas. After the missed shot, Bobcats now with the ball. From the right corner, they'll deflect a pass. Nearly stolen, still loose. Cardinals get it. Outlet pass and a quick foul call that prevents what would have been an easy layup. Another turnover by the Edinburgh Bobcats, and those are mounting up here in this ball game. That's now eight here in the second quarter and 11 in the game. 337 remaining. In the second quarter from Harlingen where the Harlingen Cardinals lead the Edinburgh Bobcats. Regular season action. Late stages of the regular season here in the Rio Grande Valley. February 2012. Cardinals with the ball. From the corner around the perimeter. Now they'll dive it inside to Cervantes. Turns, shot it, too strong. Back of the rim. Rebound, McCaleb has it for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Bobcats down just the five points. Work the ball on the left side to Garza. Flips the pass out to McCaleb. Open three. Answer, yes. Three pointer by Nick McCaleb. Cuts the lead to two. 3.04 to go here in the half. Cardinals on a little 5 0 run now. Check that. Bobcats on the 5 0 run. Cardinals trying to end that with a Robles three. Bang! Pete Robles knocks in a three. Robles takes over the team lead in scoring. With that, he's got seven. McCaleb to Rivas. Rivas spins, shot it, made it. Gabriel Rivas with a double digit output here in the first half. He's got 10. Cardinals one of three. Let it go. Pretty good look. Back to the rim. Won't go. Hits the wire support. And thus it'll be Edinburgh basketball on the prior miss. Bobcats down three. Ball deflected out of bounds. Cardinal basketball, 2.29 remaining in the half. They'll work it outside, off the dribble, elevating, flip pass outside to Ibarra. Ibarra goes inside, shot blocked out of there as Ramirez's shot was sent, but the Cardinals retain possession. 2.17 and counting here. Now the whistle and a three-second violation against the Harlingen Cardinals. Bobcats with the ball. 26-23, your score. Now work in the corner, ball knocked and a whistle blows and a foul's gonna be called. Again, I'm, I'm screened from that as well. Free throws coming up. That's the seventh team foul against the Harlingen Cardinals. To the free throw line, Emilio Trejo, Trejo for the Bobcats. Trejo shot it, missed it. Rebound Cardinals, and here they come. Pryor in the front court. Left side pass, three, answer, yes. Three pointer by Daniel Ibarra. And the Cardinals are now up six. Bobcats get the ball in the back court. Have it for a moment. Cardinals on the attack. Ramirez has it knocked away. Recovers, lost it, got it back. Bounce pass in the paint. Better shoot it, they do, and make it. Pete Robles, that was near a three-second violation. Robles with the score. 
Cards up 31-23 with a minute 30 left here in the half. Bobcast with a deflected pass, stay here. Minute 27 left. It'll be Edinburgh basketball. They're wheeling players off the bench from either team now. Late substitutions here down the stretch of quarter number two. Edinburgh to throw it in, the Bobcats. Still looking to get it in. Lob it high for Rivas, that's a nice option. They'll work it outside. Just inside the arc, bounce pass, see you later, turnover. Trejo got in the air, and once you do that, unless you're right on the money with a wide open player in front of you, bad things generally happen off of that kind of pass. Cardinal basketball, Harlingen up 31-23 in the corner. No hurry this trip down. They'll work it around the perimeter. Now they'll get to the free throw line. Real good ball movement. Open three, no good. Rebound knocked out of bounds off the Cardinals. They'll take that look. That was good ball movement and a prior three that funneled out. The Harlingen Cardinals, good execution that time on the offensive end. Minute three left here in the half. Edinburgh basketball. They've been outscored 12-7 here in the second quarter after trailing 19-16 after one, and Edinburgh will throw it away. I mean, that pass, no chance for anybody to catch that. 14 turnovers now for Edinburgh. That's unofficial. It may be low. 52 seconds left here in the half. Harlingen basketball. Reza brings it across the timeline and will dribble. Zone defense away. Timmy's in no hurry to spread the offense out. Allow the time to elapse unless Edinburgh extends the defense. Eight-point game. Harlingen on top. Pryor catches right back to Reza. Reza with 32 on the clock. Puts it on the floor with the right hand. Backs away again. Finds Pryor. Got it back. 25 on the clock. Reza puts it on the floor. Bobcat defense creeping out a little further. Cardinals play catch. Pryor recovers. Lost it again. Passes it away and it's tipped by the Edinburgh Bobcats and stay here. They were all over David Pryor that time. Fortunately for Harlingen, they didn't turn it over. 16 seconds left in the half. Reza to throw it in. Before that, a substitution off the bench for the Harlingen Cardinals wearing number 12. That's Ian Flores. Inbound play coming up for Harlingen. Pryor catches out near the midcourt area. 12 on the clock, guarded by Garza straight up. Right side pass to Robles. Nine on the clock, eight, seven, takes a look. Given room, launches a three over Rebus and made it. Robles connects. Cards head to the locker room, up 11. 34-23, 15-7 second quarter for the Harlingen Cardinals on their home floor, trying to avenge an earlier loss in good shape after a half. Hope you enjoyed the first half. I'm going to step aside and take a break. Second half coming up. This is KHGN-TV on Channel 17 and 956sports.com. News here on 956sports.com and KHGN-TV on a Friday night from Harlingen as we set the second half in motion. Harlingen Cardinals find themselves on top comfortably right now, 34-23, as we uh, resume play here in the third quarter. Inside move made. Banker goes up and in by Gabriel Rivas, and that's how quarter number three begins with a Bobcat basket. Here come the Harlingen Cardinals. They closed out the half with a three-pointer that went in by Pete Robles, who leads all scores in the night. Cardinals up. 34-25 the score. Working around the outside, making this zone work. On the baseline, Robles gets free, lays it up. No good, missed the bunny. Rebound taken down by the Edinburgh Bobcats. Bobcats scored the first two points of this third quarter. Entry pass, the Spirit Quake to catch it, shot it, made it. Back-to-back -back baskets deep inside the defensive set of the Arledge and Cardinals, and quickly, Edinburgh back to a single-digit game. Down seven, they're on the defensive end. Cards with it, work it right side. On the perimeter, working back top of the key to Reza. Reza's pass is intercepted and stolen. Here comes Garza, Reza to beat. Flips a finger roll up, no good. Rebound tipped out of bounds. Two Cardinals there and stay here. It'll be Edinburgh basketball. Edinburgh went four minutes to start the second quarter without scoring a point. Here in the third quarter, out of the gate, four quick ones. Entry pass, Mikhailov tried to force it to a spear quite and nearly stolen. Nice hustle by Charlie Powers who deflects it out of bounds. Stay here.
and they'll work the ball outside. Garza off the dribble. Hands it off to Harrison. Harrison looking for a screen, nothing there. Backs it back out near the midcourt area. Flips the pass over to Garza. Garza puts it on the floor, crossover dribble. Nearly got away with a travel that time. Revis, jumper, up, no good. Rebound of Spirit Quaita, turns for the Bobcats. Left hand, got it. Spirit Quaita with the offensive board. Bobcats on a 6-0 run have cut the lead down now to 34-29. 6-10 remaining here in the third quarter. Cardinals looking for their first points here in the second half. Open three, long three, bang of the ring, no good. Rebound, Cervantes controls it for the Arlington Cardinals. Flip pass over to Robles, three on the way. No, back of the rim again. Long rebound out to Garza, has it stolen as the Cardinals get it right back. A lot of turnovers in that second quarter by the Edinburgh Bobcats. Cardinals get it to the inside. Banker goes up, no good, and a foul called will send Charlie Powers to the line. 5.42 remaining third quarter action is Charlie Powers, the 6'3 senior. Heads to the free throw line for the Harlingen Cardinals. Powers ready with the first of two. Good. Powers, that's his first free throw opportunity on the evening. He's got five points. One of one at the line, and as a team, Card's now two of five. Second one for Powers on the way. Good again. First two points of the second half for Harlingen. Cards up seven, 36-29 the score. Bobcats with a basketball. McCaleb has it in the front court. Dribbles it with the left hand. Hands it off. Garza on the attack to the right side. Big step there, step to a double team, deflected out of bounds. Stay here, it'll be Edinburgh basketball once again. Overplay that time defensively by the Harlingen Cardinals. Nearly got the steal. Substitution off the bench. for the Edinburgh Bobcats. McCaleb to throw it in. Bounce pass right there, Esperacueta caught it, shot it, made it. Noe Esperacueta now in the game with eight. Back to a five point game, 36-31. Cardinals led 19-16 after a quarter, outscored the Bobcats 15-7 in the second. And have been outscored eight to two here in the third. Early going, still 5.09 remaining. Powers catches, puts it on the floor. One hands it, out into the hands of Ibarra. Ibarra to Robles, Robles back to Ibarra. Ibarra to Robles, over to Reza. Reza puts it on the floor from the baseline. Ball knocked out of bounds. Edinburgh touches it last, says the official. Bobcat fans won't like that one. 4.56 remaining third quarter. Cards to throw it in. Ibarra gets it in. Cervantes has his shot blocked and a foul is going to be called. McCaleb will send Cervantes to the line. Stops the clock with four minutes and 52 seconds left here in the third quarter. Thanks again for joining us here on 956sports.com and KHGN TV, channel 17 in the Harlingen area. Foul on McAuliffe is his first, and Matthew Cervantes at the free throw line. 0 for 2 on the night at the line. First one of two. No good. Cards now 3 of 7. That's 40. 3% from the free throw line. Cervantes ready with another. Eyes it. Made it. One of two. Six point game. Edinburgh basketball. They're down 37 31. 449 remaining. McCaleb in the front court. Ball intercepted. Stolen. Cards on the front way. Layup up and no good. Offensive rebound. Put it up and in. Reza there to clean it up. Ibarra with the miss. Reza with the layup. On the drive, Michaela, finger roll, no good. Quick outlet pass, and here comes Reza. No numbers, wants a three anyway. Let her go, got it. Might have been an ill-advised shot until it hit the bottom of the net. Back to an 11-point game. Cards up, 42-31, and the timeout called. As we are at the 420 mark of quarter number three. Full court pressure by the Harlingen Cardinals. Bobcats spread the floor. Revis in the backcourt to Michaela. Michaela. Dribbles it, they chase him, got it across the timeline to Harrison. Harrison dribbles away from traffic, attacks baseline, shot it, missed it. Rebound, Powers has it for the Harlingen Cardinals and back they come with an 11-point lead. Cards in no hurry as Ibarra brings it across the timeline over to Reza. Reza puts it on the floor, bounce pass intercepted. Stepping in front was a spear, Quaiton stole it for the Edinburgh Bobcats. 
Quick pass ahead to Rivas. Powers tips it out of bounds, and Robles can't get there. It's off the Cardinals. Stay here. 3.46 remaining as Garza checks back in the game for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Again, offensively, he has been held to nothing. Spiracueta will throw it in. Cards had cut the lead to single digits and got it as close to five here in this third quarter. McCaleb catches. Over to Spiracueta. Hooks inside for Rivas. Nothing there. Finds Garza instead. Garza guarded by Robles. Bounce pass to Spiracueta. Makes the move. Laid it up and in. He's now in double figures with 10. Back to a nine-point game. Harlingen with the lead. Three-pointer in rhythm. Daniel Ibarra, front of the rim, won't go. Rebound. Cards had it for a moment. Powers dives to the ground, but Garza recovers for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Attacks to a double team. Left-hand layup. No good. Foul call. Take your pick. Ibarra and Reza. Probably Reza on the contact. In this case, it's Ibarra. Free throw number one, Garza. He's off to zero. Made the free throw. Second one coming up. Garza ready with another. Made it too. Matthew Garza on the night, has two. Here's a steal, Edinburgh with it again. Garza into traffic, loses it. Stolen right back at you. Cards on a two-on-one break. Right side layup, good. Amy Garza on the finish. For Garza, he's got five. The lead is back to nine. Three-pointer launched by Edinburgh. Back of the rim, no good. Offensive rebound for a moment control, but Cervantes has it for the Cardinals. Outlet pass, here comes Pryor. Pass, got it back, layup good. Great pass by Garza. David Pryor on the finish, give a big assist that time to Jaime Garza and a timeout. Back to an 11 point game. They had cut the lead to five. Harlingen extended it back to 11. Cut it into single digits again, and now it's back to an 11 point game. Edinburgh with the basketball after the timeout. Alonzo has the ball, puts it on the floor, guarded by Garza out there, straight up defense, lost his dribble, needs some help. Gets it in the presence of Emilio Trejo, who lost it. Turnover, here come the Cardinals. Pryor has it, attacks right baseline, lost his dribble. Overhead pass, caught by Hunter. Hunter quickly with pass to Garza, who finds Ibarra. Ibarra back to Pryor, Pryor to Garza, running one hand on the baseline, that goes. Jaime Garza now has seven. Edinburgh down 13 in the backcourt. Near a carry, Michaela catches, they chase him. Takes it left side, better get it across in a hurry, can't, 10 second violation. Turnover, Harlage in defense. Gets the ball back for the Cards here on their home floor on a Friday night. Substitution off the bench for Harlage. Iron Flores checks in. Cardinal basketball, they are up 48 to 35. In the corner for three, answer, no. Offensive board though. Kick it back outside, working around the perimeter, another three, this one's short off the front of the rim. Another rebound, Cardinals get another chance, this trip down. Another three by Pryor, no. Rebound tipped again outside, nice work by Daniel Ramirez, tipping these balls out for a second and now third and fourth chances. Cardinals work it down inside. Kick it back out for another three. Answer this time by Flores won't go. Another offensive rebound as Garza secures that one. Gets it outside to Ibarra in the corner. Garza three, answer, no, an air ball. Another offensive rebound and a push is called against Edinburgh. Multiple, and I mean multiple offensive rebounds this trip down for the Harlingen Cardinals. Second foul on McAuliffe. Harlingen will get yet another chance. Pryor catches in the corner to Ibarra. Puts it on the floor, back to Pryor, over to Garza. Garza spins it left side to Flores. Over it goes to Pryor. Pryor back to Garza. Garza with a jump stop, got to the free throw line. Back of the rim, rolled it in. Jaime Garza with a finish. Whistle, timeout. 
Cardinals up 15, and that trip down, Edinburgh just couldn't get aboard, and the Harlingen Cardinals eventually scored. A lot of chances from beyond the arc, an eventual jumper by Jaime Garza. As the teams break out from the timeout, 58 seconds left here in the third quarter. Harlingen's outscored Edinburgh 16 to 12 in the third. They outscored them in the first and the second, and now the third, and lead by 15. Pressure. Bobcats trying to break the pressure. A foul called at the midcourt area will slow him down. They'll call it on Jaime Garza. That'll be just the second team foul of Harlingen here in the second half. Make that, yeah, second. Inbound play, Edinburgh. McCaleb to throw it in. That's a dangerous pass, stolen. Here comes Ramirez, lays it up, got it. Daniel Ramirez with the steal. 17-point lead, Garza a steal, he's fouled. Turnovers continue to mount here for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Garza gets to the line, stops the clock with 44 seconds left. Harlingen's JV squad won earlier here. Varsity trying to complete the sweep. Garza makes the first. Aaron Martinez wearing 32 checks in the ball game for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Noe Espiriqueta returns as well. Garza ready with another. He's now in double figures with 10. Make it 11 as he hits the next free throw. And that extends the lead to 19. At one time, it was a five-point game here in this third quarter. McCaleb in all kinds of trouble. Throws it finally off of Garza. And Edinburgh will get another chance to get it across the timeline. McCaleb to Espiricueta. Back to McCaleb. Spins, has numbers, works it, pass, deflected, and out of bounds it goes. Cardinals can't get there. It'll be Edinburgh ball. 29 seconds left here in the third. 54-35. Inbound play. They'll work it in the corner. Bobcats now look inside for Spiriqueta, and over the top comes Daniel Ramirez to commit a foul. Spiriqueta had sealed him off. Got good position on the blocks. Non-shooting foul, team foul number three. Inbound play coming up for Edinburgh. They triple team Espiriqueta, so they'll flip it out and set the offense up from there. On the attack, whistle, jump ball. Great defense that time played by Josh Tapia for the Harlingen Cardinals. Substitutions in the ball game for Edinburgh. 20 seconds left here in the third. Harlingen basketball in the backcourt. David Pryor runs the point this trip down. They spread the floor with 14 on the clock across the timeline. Right wing to Garza, back to Pryor. Pryor waits with eight, puts it on the floor. Six seconds, five, Garza, baseline move with three. Missed the layup. Rebound, Michaela out the pass. We won't get a shot off in time. Bobcats outscored in that one, 20 to 12. Harlingen Cardinals balloon the lead to 19. 54 to 35, your score with eight minutes left here in the ball game now as quarter number four is upon us. It'll be Edinburgh basketball and they got a long way to go here. See if they can start connecting from beyond the arc. It's not beyond them to do so. Problem is you got a stifling defense against you. Michaela, every second now that goes off that clock has lost chances. Michaela spins, gets to the free throw line and that'll help if you're an Edinburgh Bobcat fan. Michaela will get to the line. Stopping the clock with seven minutes and 44 seconds left here in the game. Michaela tonight, 11 points, five rebounds, four of four at the free throw line. Two shots coming up here, first one, good. So free throw shooting still for the Bobcats, letter perfect, that's nine in a row as a team. Michaela with another. Made that as well. Takes over the team lead in scoring with now 13 points. Harlingen beats the pressure with a three. Robles, no, back of the rim. Offensive rebound, Powers has a shot block. Cervantes is there, tips it a couple of times. Loose ball, still tipped around. Finally, Cardinals get it. Cervantes gets it out for a raise, a three. Answer, no, front of the rim. Cervantes keeps it alive again, put it up, no good. Rebound, tip up, out of bounds. We'll go the other way. Matthew Cervantes. Refusing to give up rebound chance after chance after chance for the Harlingen Cardinals. Edinburgh ball, they're down 17. Off the drive, kicking out for a quick jumper on the side that won't go. 
Robles gets the rebound. Ball tipped out of bounds. It'll be Harlingen basketball. Cardinals up 17. Work the ball across the timeline. Reza flips it back out to Ibarra. Gets it over to Robles. Robles looks inside. Powers had him sealed. They didn't give him the ball. Get it to Cervantes. Cervantes dribbles at one time. Finds Robles. Robles attacks baseline. Reverse layup. Got it. Pete Robles on the finish. He's got 14. Cardinals back up by 19 at 56 to 37. Edinburgh basketball as McCaleb looks inside and there'll be a hold against Cervantes. Just shy of sumo wrestling with Gabriel Rivas on the blocks, trying to prevent Gabriel to get that position. Inbound play coming up for Edinburgh's Bobcats. They'll get it in for a quick three. Harrison can't hit. Rebound by Cervantes for the Harlingen Cardinals. What's the traffic clear? Here come the cards. Ibarra to Cervantes, attacks, hands it off to Powers, lays it up, missed it, got fouled. Charlie Powers makes his way to the line. 6.21 remaining in the game. Powers will be shooting two. First foul on Harrison of the night. Powers on the evening, two of two at the free throw line. Makes the first here. He's the bright spot shooting wise from the free throw line for Harledge in this evening. There's seven of 11 as a team. Of the seven made, he's got three of them. Looking for another here, also looking for his eighth point of the night. Is Charlie Powers, the 6 3 senior. Got it. 58 37. 21 point lead. McCaleb into Rivas, goes to work, shot it, missed it, he got fouled. Cervantes gonna be called for the foul, although he thought he blocked the shot. Gabriel Rivas, who was busy early in the game, had been quiet for a long period here, scoring-wise, and now steps to the free throw line, where on the night he's two of two, and as a team, his Edinburgh Bobcats are 10 of 10. Free throw number one, good. That's 38 points scored as a team, 11 of those coming from the free throw line. That's, I think, the biggest stat line of the night. It's not just that it's a 20-point lead for Harlingen, it's that they've held this Edinburgh team from an offensive standpoint to just 38 points and 28 of those coming other than from the free throw line. Running one-hander, no good, missed by the Cardinals. Rebound right there, Powers put it up and in. Cervantes again kept it alive long enough for Powers to control it. And Charlie Powers on the finish. 22-point lead for Harlingen. McCaleb launches a three. Bang. Nick McCaleb has now 16 points, leads the Edinburgh Bobcats in scoring. Cardinals answering with a three in the corner that's well short. Rebound by Harrison for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Into the front court. Ball knocked away. On the turnover, here come the Arlington Cardinals. No numbers, Ibarra backs it out, up nine, or check that, up 60 to 41. Cervantes catches. Puts the ball high, puts it on the floor against Rivas. Attacks, running left-hander, won't go. Rebound taken down by the Edinburgh Bobcats. Three on two, stolen by the Cardinals. Restolen by the Bobcats, whistle and a foul call. It's gonna be on Robles. And check that, it's gonna be on Edinburgh. 5.07 remaining. 60 to 41 the score. Harlingen to inbound the basketball. Robles in the backcourt, sees full court pressure applied by the Edinburgh Bobcats. Throws it to Ibarra. Daniel Ibarra in the backcourt, guarded by Michaela. Gets a screen from Powers, didn't need it, waves him off. Handles it down the sideline, got away from the defense. Hands it off, Cervantes, open jumper that won't go. Espiriqueta gets the rebound for the uh, Edinburgh Bobcats. Edinburgh with 4.49 left in this game. Down 60 to 41. McCaleb off the three, off the dribble, no good. Rebound, Daniel Ibarra has it for the Harlingen Cardinals. Cardinals work off the dribble. Handed off to Powers, missed the banker. Rebound tip, quickly out come the Edinburgh Bobcats. Attacking, running shot, goes up and in, and free throws coming up. Aaron Martinez. For the basket. 
And he'll head to the line. The 5'10 senior, that's his first points of the evening. 60 to 43 the score. Edinburgh's outscored Harlingen here in this fourth quarter. Eight to six. Martinez ready to go, trying to complete a three-point play. Eyes it. And missed it, in front of the rim. Rebound, goes out of bounds. It'll be Edinburgh basketball, says the official. Asper Quaita doesn't think so. He's already down on the other end playing defense. Now we got an official time. As from the sideline, one of the teams want to talk. Fourth minute, 26 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. In the third quarter, it looked like Edinburgh had something going. They jumped out of the gate, out of the halftime locker room, and cut the lead to five. And then Harlingen found another gear, outscored him 20 to 12. And here we are, three-pointer out of the timeout. Missed by Matthew Garza, the Edinburgh Bobcats, and it's Harlingen basketball with 4.16 left in the game. Jaime Garza has the ball. Spins away from McCaleb, finds Ibarra. Ibarra puts it on the floor, flips a pass to Powers, lays it up, blocked out of there. Offensive board, though. Cervantes misses the stick back. Rebound, Edinburgh. Bobcats, another chance here. Garza attacks on the baseline. Has his pass deflected, maintains control, steps to a double team, whistle and a foul called on Ibarra. Harlingen defense not backing down a bit. A lot of reaching, though. Thus, the foul called on Ibarra. Should be a one and one coming up for Matthew Garza. As that's the eighth team foul on Harlingen. Garza to the free throw line. We're on the night. He's two of two. First one. Good. That's a lone bright spot here this evening for the Edinburgh Bobcats. That's now 12 of 14, 86% from the free throw line. Garza ready with another. Made it. 60 to 45. 15 point ball game. Edinburgh got to get busy, got to have to gamble defensively. Cardinals make them pay, lay up good. Amy Garza with a layup. He's got 13. Back to a 17 point game. 338 remaining. Michaela to Rivas. Rivas, they'll work it around over to Garza right side. Flips it back inside to Rivas. Goes to work, jump hook, got it. Gabriel Rivas has 15. Harlingen still up 15 with the ball. 3.20 to go, fourth quarter. They'll work it right side. Into traffic, no good. Cervantes right there on the backside, put it up and in. Offensive stick back for Matthew Cervantes for the Harlingen Cardinals. They're back up 17. Exchanging baskets will not work if you're an Edinburgh Bobcat. Going to have to at some point make some kind of serious run. Shot blocked out of there by Cervantes on the Rivas attempt. Now in the backcourt, before the ball advances, the whistle blows and the timeout's called. Covering some of the younger kids, eighth grade. There's a fourth grade team they're asking me to cover as well. Let's see if I can, I don't know that I've done many fourth grade games. Harledge and basketball after the timeout. Powers to Garza, ball deflected, turnover by the cards. And it'll be Edinburgh basketball. 2.48 remaining, fourth quarter action. McCaleb brings it up. He leads the team in scoring tonight with 16. Flips the pass to Garza. Garza goes inside to Rivas. Rivas spins a pass over. Right side jumper, short offensive rebound. Put it up, no good. Offensive rebound again, put it up, no good. And a foul call, then Rivas gonna get to the line. Gabriel Rivas. As the clock stops with two minutes and 29 seconds to go. Fourth foul of the night on Charlie Powers on this one. Rivas, three of four from the free throw line this evening. First one of two, no. He's now missed two in a row. And as a team, they've missed three overall. Still 81% free throw shooting for Edinburgh's Bobcats this evening. Rivas hits the next one. 64-48. Harlingen basketball, they've led since the end of the first quarter. Haven't looked back, really. Right side to Garza. Puts it on the floor to Ibarra. Spread the floor, Ibarra back to Garza. Right side, all the way in, laid up, no gets good. Nobody stopped Garza on that one, easy layup. 
2.06 to go. McCaleb attacks. Whistle. Foul call. Garza thought he had it clean. Official said no, and McCaleb will get to the free throw line for Edinburgh. Two minutes and five seconds left here in the fourth quarter. 66-48, Harlingen on top. McCaleb ready. Good on the first. Nick McCaleb now is the leading scorer on the night with 17 points. Rivas right behind him was 16. McCaleb also seven of seven at the line. Second one here, perfect. Powers gets it in for Harlingen. Two minutes left. They beat him down court. Robles hesitates. Reverse layup. Can't get it to go. Cervantes there again. Get it back outside to Robles. And Cervantes has been a horse in the paint. A lot of times he hasn't got credit for rebounds as the Cardinals turn it over. But Cervantes is the man on the spot keeping the balls alive. A couple of chances earlier in the game. He never did get credit for a rebound, but he tipped it out at least three different times on a missed shot to teammates that kept the possession alive long enough for Harlingen to eventually score. A lot of parents may be wondering why certain players remain in ball games, late stages of games, especially late in the regular season. It's all about getting set up for playoff time and how your players react to timeouts and being, again, instructed what to do out of these timeouts. See what Edinburgh draws up. Bobcats with the ball in the backcourt. McCaleb across the timeline. Plays catch with Trejo. Garza catches. Back to Trejo. Minute 43 left and counting. Garza has it for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Whistle blows away from the ball. And they're going to get Harlingen. Now call it on Jaime Garza. So that'll stop the clock and allow free throws for Emilio Trejo for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Free throw, no good. A rare miss this evening from the free throw line for Edinburgh. Trejo ready to go with another one. Made it. 66-51, backcourt pressure by Edinburgh. Down 15 points. Harlingen with the ball in the backcourt. Hunter got in the air, passed it ahead. Now they Trying to go further ahead. Ball knocked out of bounds. Touch last by Edinburgh. And it will be. Harlingen basketball with a minute 29 left. They'll get it in. Layup up, no good. Tip, Edinburgh with the ball. McAuliffe brings it up. Across the timeline, open jumper, three, short, no good. Rebound, Harlingen all over that. Robles dribbles out of traffic into a double team and lost it. Trejo on the steal, got in the air, gets it out for a Garza three, no. Garza got his own rebound. His shot's blocked out of bounds, stay here. Minute five remaining. Inbound play coming up for the Edinburgh Bobcats. Bobcats got them on their home floor. Cardinals returning the favor here this evening. Jumper, back of the rim, no good. Long rebound out to Robles for Harlingen. Under a minute left, Robles knocked to the ground. He'll go to the line. John Guerra going to call be called for the foul. Guerra, the six-foot senior in the game. And now we got a whistle for substitutions to check in. Inbound play coming up for the Harlingen Cardinals. They throw it in. Nice pass. Cervantes catches, shot it, made it. Matthew Cervantes with seven. Big night for him. Statistically, it may not look as big as what it was. 
Shot by Garza, splashes home for the Edinburgh Bobcats. 37 seconds remaining here in this one. Cardinals up 68-53 in the backcourt, Ibarra dribbles through some traffic. Finds Powers, Cervantes finds Hunter, back to Cervantes, plays catch. Hunter again, they chase him, get it to Cervantes, spread the floor to the Harlingen Cardinals. Cervantes attacks, got upended and sent to the ground hard. And that'll be an ejection here in this game. Cervantes, they attend to him on the side. 19 seconds left in this one. Still attending to Matthew Cervantes, who took a hard spill after contact was made. On a foul called on Guerra. Cervantes gets up to a round of applause. Now Guerra's gonna be ejected in this game. He, he, was, he was running in the direction of Cervantes. And it, it looked uglier than what it really was. He caught him with a left shoulder and just kind of ran through him. And that's where the official is going to make that call. 19.6 seconds left in this one. Two shots coming up on the what is now an intentional foul. And then Cervantes will get a chance to shoot a free throw on a one and one attempt, unless they go for two here. They call that active shooting. Gilbert Reza at the line. First one good. But Reza on the night, he's got 11. That's his first free throw attempt. Second one here for the junior. It's good. <laughs> 19 point six seconds to go. They lob it inside. Powers misses the layup. Rebound, tipped out, still loose. Finally tipped, three or four players touch it again, still loose, finally controlled by the Cardinals with nine seconds left. Daniel Ibarra dribbles away, hands it off to Reza with four. Three, two, one, ball game. Harlingen Cardinals defeat the Edinburgh Bobcats on a Friday night in Harlingen. Final score, 70 to 53. Run down your scoring real quick because they're gonna shut the lights off real quick here tonight in Harlingen, I got a feeling. Run down the Cardinals scoring first. On the winning side, Jaime Garza finishes with 15 to lead the team in scoring. Pete Robles right behind him with 14. Gilbert Reza had 12. And Charlie Powers with 10. Daniel Ibarra also on the night with eight points for the Harlingen Cardinals. Matthew Cervantes had seven additional players to score with Daniel Ramirez and David Pryor with two apiece. For the Edinburgh Bobcats, it was 18 points for Nick McCaleb to lead the way, followed by 16 for Gabriel Rivas. 10 points for Noe Espiracueta, 6 points for Matthew Garza, and 2 points for Aaron Martinez, 1 for Emilio Trejo. Hope you enjoyed the broadcast again. Had two headsets on this evening, announcing for both Channel 17 and 956sports.com. Not the first time I've done it, probably won't be the last. Hope you enjoyed the broadcast, my friends. Tune in again. Until next time, from Harlingen, where the Cardinals beat the Edinburgh Bobcats 70-53. to Good night, everybody.